This is Katie Hunter from MA UK. I'm here with your winner, Jerome Scott. That was so impressive. Thank you, thank you very much. It was a tough opponent, um, and I knew it was going to be tough, but I'm happy I come away, get the win, and get the finish as well. What a way to open the card. You gave, there's a big crowd in there already, and you were very popular. You gave them something to cheer about. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, I had a lot more supporters come out, so I'm very thankful for them for coming and showing me support. Um, it definitely spurred me on, especially from the first round into the second round. And it was good to know that it was out in full force supporting me, so I was happy about that. Yeah. Talk me through the finish. Yeah, the finish, um, at first, because at the end of the first round, he took me down um, due to a kick. So the second round, I got in close. I was able to like, kind of um, suplex him up and take him down. I wasn't trying to go for the, um, for the red naked choke at first, but because the opportunity presented itself, I just took it. Yeah. Well, Dick, given how the fight was going, I thought there was going to be a striking finish. So yeah. you really mixed it up. Yeah, yeah. That's what I like to do. It's MMA. You can't just be one dimensional. One dimensional. You've got to have to have like, all facets of the sport. So I was happy I was able to show that as well. I'm not just a striker, I'm not just a wrestler. You know what I mean? I could do everything. Wherever the fight goes, I'm okay. Yeah, you definitely can. And that's three wins in a row, four and one as a pro. Oh, yeah. Four and one now as a pro. I fought some good, tough opponents. Um, yeah. So I'm quite pleased with myself to always come out on top. And obviously, this is another opportunity where I can watch back and learn and improve myself. A hundred percent. Is this a multi-fight contract with Yes, so I've got four more fights with them. I'm looking to fight as much as possible, whether it's here, whether it's Manchester, whether it's Ireland, anywhere they want to throw me, I don't mind taking it. Ireland's only next week. You ready for uh, Yeah, I ain't got no bruises, so we could go. I just got to make the wait. <laughs> well, Scotland's only a few weeks after that. Yeah, so... um. I'm going to watch back, I'll speak to my coach and see how, how quickly I can get back in there. Yeah. And whatnot, because the making weight, I'm not going to lie to you, yeah. I don't like it. Well, flyweight is hard. It's tough, it is very tough. Um, and people think just because we're smaller sometimes, because it's easier. It's not, man, it's not. It's very difficult, but I'm happy I'm able to make it. Yeah. Yeah. Would you fight at Bantam, like just for an extra fight in between? Or? It would have to be the right opponent. Yeah, yeah you know, they're, they're quite bigger and whatnot. So if it's the right you opponent. You can get some massive Bantam weights. I'm telling you, you know, I spar with some massive Bantam weights. Yeah, of course you do. trouble, you know what I mean? So, yeah, man, I'm, I'm ready to fight whoever and whenever, as long as it's, um, the show's good and the right opponent, of course. And former teammate and, uh, sorry, former opponent and now teammate Lonnie Kavanagh on the card tonight. Tell me what we can expect from him. From Lon, you can, ex you can expect what you got from me and more. The guy's explosive, he's exciting, um, he always comes for the finish, uh, he's got crazy power and he trains extremely hard as well, so I've um, got no doubt he's going to come out on top. Let's go, Lon! Let's go, Lonnie. And also, one more thing, I asked you about that gap in, in um, fighting MMA from 2017 to 22 and you said you were boxing. Is your focus now purely on MMA or will you be boxing as well? No, purely MMA now, nothing else. I don't compete. Well, obviously, I was also competing in Olympic weightlifting as well at that time. Wow. So, yeah, I was doing quite a bit. But once I made the switch to turn up a pro, everything else was on the back foot. And professional MMA was what I'm mostly focused on. So, yeah, I'm here to stay. Well, whatever Cage Warriors card you're on next, I'm excited to be watching. I'll be tuning in. Thank you very much. Um, I'll try to get out there as much as possible as well. So yeah, thanks guys for coming out and supporting me and it's a pleasure to always fight for Cage Warriors and whatnot. Obviously, I fought a lot as an amateur as well, so it's good to be back here now as yeah. a pro. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you.